I think that um, Scratch is special because it's not only a programming language, it is also an online community where uh, students, teachers and kids get together to share their ideas and, and their projects. Uh, it's so special that you can easily share your project and remix the project of another person. So I think that when we're talking of Scratch, uh, we don't need to talk about only a programming language. It's more than that. It's an online community. Well, I cannot tell uh, about other teachers. I can tell about my own experience. Um, I think that Scratch um, changed, changed me the way I teach all the subjects. Um, I became uh, more aware of leaving students their space to think, um, to give an opportunity to uh, explore, uh, to manipulate. So in this case, in my opinion, in my own experience, uh, Scratch has, um, has done um, a lot of work to foster a new way of learning. Well, I don't know if it's important. I think that it's necessary. Um, now in the 21st century, um, we need, uh, we need people to know how the machines work, not to be um, uh, programmers or study uh, computer science, just to know how, how the world works. Well, I'm very excited about the future of uh, Scratch. Um, Scratch 2.0 it's a fantastic uh, environment. I like the way that it makes it. It makes a very easy sharing projects. But I, I I'm, uh, I'm very excited about the extension blocks, like connecting uh, hardware to Scratch and easily um, uh, use Lego We Do or Google Maps, as we have seen uh, minutes ago. So I'm. I think the future will be like. It will be related to the things that we will connect to the to the language. Well, it's kind of funny because a Scratch um, conference in Barcelona started in a bar, in a bar in um, near Media Lab last last summer. We were talking about um, uh, it was very hard for European teachers to pay the cost of the travel to Media Lab, so we said, hey, it would be a good idea to have a, a Scratch conference in in Barcelona. So Hugh van Manfor just wrote it on the wall. And I had the bad idea to took a picture of it and post it into Twitter. And after five minutes, people from here, from City Lab, just said, hey, we want to do this. So uh, I've been uh, part of the, of the team that started this. And I'm very proud and I'm very thankful to, to all the people that make it possible.